Welcome back, everybody. Farming Simulator 19 here on Ravenport. Woohoo! Your host with, eh, not the most, Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller. How y'all doing today, folks? Y'all doing all right? Well, I was doing all right if I didn't have to sell this. I, I, I like it because, I don't know, because of the raptor on the side of it, but the raptor is giving us problems. It'll start fine. I'll start tabbing around the vehicles and I'll go back to it and it don't work no more. So it's mod issue. Uh, not the mod itself. It's just, it's probably glitching with some of the other mods I got. I got 400 and something mods. Probably about 430 something mods in my folder. Uh, three or four maps in there. So we're going to sell her. The wrapper itself is in good condition. $219,159. Four days ago. We're selling. Ooh, it gets us back up there. Okay. Alright, we're going to repair this and it's only fair. $43,920 back. So, brings us to two eighty-eight. Alright, we got to run around here. Yeah, we got a big board down here. Alright, now what are we going to do now? Well, big boy here is going to have to have another poop spreader. So let's go on over to this one right here. This is an end game one. 30,000 liters instead of 42. It should work though. Um, ooh. Let's go with the not, uh, not Kayan, not no, no Kogan. I can't say it right. But anyway, big difference in price, so big difference. So we got one hundred twenty-two thousand dollars left. Wow. All right, let's get out of the store before I spend more money. Uh, we're gonna get this bad boy loaded back up. Uh, today we're going to be doing a harvest uh, 14 through 17. I'm going to try anyway. But I, I just want to get this on camera so y'all believe me that I had that much money back. Yeah. That hooked up quick. Alright, we're going to. Let's see here. We're going to have to delete that course. Uh, we got to go to market. Do farm. We're going to drive course. Stop at the last. All right. Bunch of tabbing to do. We got our tanker down here. We got a little bit of that field where to do. And then we'll be done with it. Moving over to here. Uh, we got some grass we need to cut. I'm gonna go, and go ahead and get a worker on this and then I'll finish the rest of it off screen. We gotta get uh, some hay made since we're getting kind of low. Whoa, doing a tailspin. Alrighty. Hmm. Alright, who, who are we gonna get to drive this? Let's see here. Looks like, zoom up in here, crucial. All right, down below in the description, folks, y'all know the routine. All right, here we are. I ain't gonna tab no more. Got the semi truck over there. We'll check it out here in a minute. Let's get this combine going. Uh, go ahead and unfold that. I don't know what it is that unfolds, but it's got to unfold something. All right, and unfold that. All right, and we are. Do we? Oh, wrong one. All right. Uh, control S. We're going to use GPS on this. 
Uh, oh, it's already set on the name for us. Uh, we just got to do auto whip. And we're going to turn that off. And that should do it. We just got to... Oh, we got a offset. Why didn't y'all tell me about the offset? We set that to zero. Um... that yeah I guess that's our width looks about right we want to have to move that over quite a bit so uh, left alt and page down we're gonna go about right there and make sure we get everything let me go ahead and clear this guy out real quick folks uh, stop driver. I'm going to pull him on over here just in case we send something else down here. Um, Gotta hurry up and get this harvest out of the way so we can do some mowing. Even my uh, camper up there is getting all grown up. Oh, look at that. I did that without even hitting anything. Okay, okay, we're gonna close that out real quick. F1 uh, R to refill. And hopefully that will keep refilling for us as we tab back through our cycle. There we go. Alright. Locked on GPS. Fire this baby up. Now let's go to town, folks. Um, oh, hang on. Lock back on. And now, that should work. Uh, uh, close this out. I wish we could hire a worker going this way. I could probably do course play, but I think we're just going to do some of this like this. Uh, let me zoom in a little bit. Actually, I do want to go back and course play. Uh, Mini HUD, we want to. Uh, I'm going to show you. Well, look right here behind the combine. You see it? it says no course loaded down at the bottom there, bottom center of the screen. To get rid of that on. Um, you go to the little gear sprocket mini HUD. You want to deactivate that. Now, there's no course loaded symbol down there. Yeah, we're doing pretty good. But, um, this is going to be, uh, I, I already used this tag, so. I'm not going to count this and then today's tag, but that's if I can find it again. Looking at my list here, yeah. Uh, I believe it was, I'm going to insert it right now. Christy, Nicola. Oh, please don't hit. Oh, we hit. Y'all didn't see that, folks. I did not hit that pole. I didn't hit it. I swear I didn't. But anyway, Christy and Nicola, uh, I'm going to find the tag, the uh, comment that she wrote. Uh, we was talking about the other the other map, the uh, New Woodshire. Oh, train coming. Hello, train. But we was talking about the New, uh, new Woodshire map, I believe. Um about the cows or something. I, I can't remember exactly, but uh, she said something about now she needs is uh, milk. So I'm like, hmm. It's funny that you mentioned that. Because that's going to be a part of uh, this map's project that we're fixing to do. Uh, 
Um, <laughs> Y'all probably like, well, Mr. Blue, what are you talking about? Well, folks, we are going to get cows on this map, and we're going to have some milk. But we got it's got to be after harvest. We got to get our beans harvested and out of the way, and all that fun stuff, you know. Um, field nine and ten. Which is what we're going to next after this is up on a hill over there. We are going for there or up by field one, two, and three. Somewhere up in that area, we're going to put a cow pasture or two. We're going to start raising cows. One of our chicken pens are full, so uh, no more chickens in it. So we're going to work on filling the other chicken pens up. Uh, we're going to get some more sheep as I believe ice demon. Uh, probably about a week or so ago. Uh, was wanting uh, more. Said we need more sheep. And we're going to get them. I got the truck loaded with wool. And the money we get from the wool. We're going to buy nothing but more sheep with that. So, yeah, we're going to uh, up our animal game after this harvest. And I'm pretty sure I got a loan I need to pay off, too. So, going to get that paid off. I was hoping the soybeans are doing pretty good. But soybeans, they're always, it takes a lot to, to get a crop out of it. Uh, you know, they... they uh, can't think of the word I'm looking for right now. It, it takes a lot of them, but the price for them makes up for it. Now, I can't think of the word I'm trying to say, but that production of them is, it takes a lot, in other words. I don't think I'm going to make it to the end, though. I was hoping to make a... <laughs> and there I go, contradicting myself or whatever what that's called. Uh, yeah, I was saying, you know, I was hoping I wouldn't make it around. they do better. But uh, and I just said, I hope I make it to the end. So, which one is it, Mr. Blue? And also, by the way, if uh, you hear some background noise... I'm recording with the AC and the ceiling fan on because it's hotter than a firecracker in my room right now. Can I make it? Oh, I'm getting mighty close. Getting mighty close. It, if I get full, I'll run over my crops if I'm going fast. So that's why I slow down. Oh, come on, come on, make it to the end, make it to the end. Yes. All right. I'm going to get right here. We're going to go ahead and unload. Wasn't bad. Also, we got to realize that's the big, biggest hopper there is, I think, so far. Which, no, it, they are bigger ones unrealistically bigger ones but hey train to made it around again or is that another one <laughs> all right we'll be sitting here for ages <sighs> we got room for a semi truck now we're gonna run over here since the train's done made it we ain't got very much left though I'm thinking about just leaving it here uh, oops, wrong one. Did it again. There we go. I think the front's full. We'll just leave it right there and just drive the tractor across. Are we still unloading? Yes, it's still unloading. Yay!
Sorry, folks. I, I think that's going to make a good thumbnail. Oh, can I have that installed? I guess not. Oh, well, we'll do it about right there. Got to get those thumbnails. Whoa, okay, mister. You should be. Yeah, almost close. Well, well my, uh, while we're waiting, let's go in here and look at our animals. The sheeps are doing good. Um, as you can see, this is the one that's full. We got 131, 138 roosters, and 131 browns. So I feel that pin up, but as you can see, we've got a long ways. Same pin, so it'll be that number there down here. Kind of, sort of, except the roosters. I went too many roosters on that. But they are doing pretty good. Uh, I got a guy hired uh, coming out and cleaning them. He cleans all the animals, actually. Um, horses, still pretty much as they was yesterday. Well, actually, this is the same day as yesterday, so. Oh, we are done. All right. I'll get this baby fired back up. And we're going to go for another round, folks. I like it straight away because I get to talk to y'all better. But I am 17 minutes into this video. God, where does the time go, folks? It just seems like I just started. Hmm. I think if I get up here at the top, I can hire a worker. Of course, I'll probably leave some, but then again, you know, I probably wouldn't. But anyway, yes, uh, on the animals, we are going to get more sheep. We're going to get a cow pasture. Um, I got some other plans expensive plans that will help us make money also um, we got grass work after this we got field work also so yeah but the, the grass is going to be for the animals um, making more hay for the horses and for the sheep and stuff but our beans we, we need to do that our beans let's see our soybean price is 14 15 rising that's going down into central grain I want pork grain elevator prices to go on up but they're going down so we may have to put them in storage I, I don't really know on that part yet But right now, oops. all right, I got a worker doing it now. We're going to see if it lines up right right here. Uh, look like we got Sarah. Good doggy. I, I figured that was going to happen, so... Uh, fire and then we're going to get this little spot and then I'm going to overlap some so I get that spot down there and then we're going to test out worker and see how well it can do this field all right Apparently that, uh, okay, on New Woodshire, I put a mod in, and when you start the combine, the header stays up. I guess it don't work for the modded ones, because I, I got every mod there is activated on this map. 
Okay. Let's see what else we can get into while this is... Yeah, we'll be all right for a minute on that. I want, oh, yeah, I want to show y'all this. Got that new flatbed, but it's not an auto load. I wish somebody would make a auto load uh, flatbed this size. It would be so awesome for the contracts for hauling and stuff. But uh, some of these are single use pallets, and as you can see, some of them are regular pallets from the thing, but we got three more pallets over. Uh, one's completely full, one's fixing to be full, and then our spare while we go sell. And uh, I'm thinking uh, we're going to probably sell pretty soon because it's 9.36 and that wool should be going up pretty soon should be um, I still got some seeds in this still trying to get them out so hopefully this heart or this planting season will get them all out oh I did not keep filling why but it feels fast so alright let's uh Let's start on this field here. Go ahead and unfold this bad boy. If I can make it over here before it gets folded all the way out. Oh, that was close. Oh, I gotta get over some more. Gotta get over a little bit more. Get up here. Now I'm back up. We'll probably waste a lot here because, of course, this one should be a little bit easier to pull because we don't have the weight of all that from the other. And this one's real easy. It should be. Let's see how we load slurry. There we go. Um, let's turn on slurry and fold slurry. Simple, simple, simple. Alright, here we go. And who is activated? Now get over, get over. You can see the slight difference in the texture there. Gotta go faster than six mile an hour. I didn't check the working speed, probably 12. And I did redo the uh, back, the pallets on the chickens here. They all got single use, I mean, uh, reusable pallets now. Uh, I think set for the far end, or is it? Yeah, the one that's straight ahead of us. Oh, I'm overlapping too much. Scoot over. But one thing about using this, it's it's free. We can use this on all our fields. Uh, the first time around, that that's going to save us a lot of money, lots of money. I just gotta get used to driving this what is it articulated tractor. Well at least we made uh three quarters of the way around, pretty much. Wish there's a way to raise the wings up, though. Now I'm going to shut off right there. 
Oh, you can tell it good right there. Um, there is no way to raise the wings up on it, so that is going to have to drag the ground. All right, before we get going any further, I want to go over here and show y'all. Um, we got single use and a single use, but you can pick these pallets up. I know this is unrealistic, but watch this. I think I showed it on the last episode, not for sure. See there? You can, you can do that. Oh crap, I didn't get it fast enough. It's oops, that's, that's what I get for trying to show my muscles off. But anyway, what I usually do is put these guys in, and if I have a single loop use like this, I'll top them off by hovering one of these reusable ones over. That's another way you can get the pallets filled up faster. But anyway, I was coming over here to show you we got three egg pallets ready. They're single use, so they will disappear. Uh, we might go sell them here in a little bit. I want to get a, a big egg sale. Let's go check on our combine. I, I feel like we need to check on it. Oh, we got to get in our tractor. I what I, I had it right there in front of me. Well, same soybeans full. Wasn't paying attention. All right, let's get on up here. All right, I would be on the wrong side. Miss Sanders on the wrong side. But I don't see nothing right here where she's been missing. So. It won't take long to get this. Yeah, I need to turn that off before it gets me in trouble. All right, I'm gonna have to fire you for a second, Miss Sandra. Well, folks, I'm gonna go ahead and, while we're unloading here, I'm gonna go ahead and insert the two tags for today and here they go right now alright what do you think about that go down in the description down below folks check them out check all the other links out while you're there uh, each and every one of them special in a way now, if your name's not in the description, don't get upset. I'm just, I got to save some room for the title, you know, for the credits for the music and stuff. That's what I'm trying to say. So, if your name's not in there, folks, if you can't find the person's name in the description, come back a little bit or, or look down in the comments because most of the time, one of those people that I use an attack, they're going to comment sooner or later. So they should be in the comments or in the description. And I, I'm trying to pin my first comment. Uh, sometimes I forget or I'm busy at that moment and it'll be later when I pin it. But uh, when I, sometimes it's hard to get the first one. Because it's just so close together on the time wise. If y'all have any. Any idea. Help me how to figure that out. Uh, down to. The. Uh, second or whatever. It would uh, help me out. Quite a bit. <clears throat> Bean dust. Oof. Tractor getting dirty. But uh. Yeah, I'm uh, trying to pin my first comment. 
because you know you might have I, I know it's like on other youtubers you'll all okay I'll come back and get that but I'll have a, I'll be watching uh, be like uh, first comment I'm first I'm first you'll have like four or five people say they're first and uh I'm like, I'm glad I don't have that problem. Which, you know, going up there in subs, it, it probably, uh, they probably will get that way. I'm just going to set right here. Oh, yeah, trying, uh, let me get up this way. Yeah, I need a bigger boy. I need big boy on this thing because we're getting these heels. It's rough. We're going to park right here. But yeah, I, so far I've been catching. Uh, you know, I, I usually catch the first one that comes in because I've got the YouTube uh, studio app. YouTube studio? Is that it? App on my phone. And it, it kind of helps remind me. Well, folks, um, oh, we got Miss Sandra back. All right. That worked out just about right. But I'm going to go ahead and uh, finish this field off and come back here in a second with the total. So how much beans we got off of here or try to so far everything's been in the, the auger wagon so yeah I will see y'all in just a few seconds uh, that way this one won't be so long so I'll be right back in a second folks I promise there won't be no continued stuff or at least I hope not <laughs> Oh, yeah, I got to come back. Well, no, no I meant Miss Sanders got to come back and get that. I'm going to be back in a second, folks. I promise. I'll be right back. All right, folks. Um, told you I'd be back. Just about done. Just about. We're going to wrap up 14 through 17. This is probably going to be uh, uh, harvest number two. Or part two of the soybean harvest something like that I have no idea the title it always comes to me at the worst moments and I always forget to write it down but our next field is going to be nine and ten and then seven seven is going to be the last since it's right there by the BGA we'll probably just park the combine under the shed there uh, folks 14 through 17 is done. It's done, huh? Just in time, too. The kids freaks will be here from school. All right. Oh, let's stop fast. It's going to take forever to unload this thing, though. But anyway, um, while this is unloading, I just want to say I uh, love each and every one of y'all. I appreciate all that y'all do, folks. I cannot say that enough. I can't stress, uh, stress it enough or, or whatever the saying is. But, um, yeah, I, I really love each and every one of y'all. I appreciate everything y'all do to help me out and stuff. Um, oh, I'm just going to park this right here. Oh. And get over here, everything off this field fit into this grain cart, so it's not very much. Uh, 76,661. Ooh, three sixes. Ooh. Oh, this will definitely fill our, our truck up. And uh, what I want to do off screen, that silo right there in front of us over there, train track silo. I'm going to put the soybeans in it. And um, we're just going to store them.
because I'm thinking Port Grain Elevator is going to be the best price. I'm not for sure. But um, we're going to go that route. And the money I got up there, and when y'all come back next week, weekend, in that, uh, our episode, don't think that when it's down to zero. Um, I think I'm going to buy more chickens with it. Is there a train coming? No, don't see no train. We're going to kind of diagonal across here. We got to get a bigger tractor on this because it's not wanting to pull it full. Well, we're not even full yet. So, um, yeah, folks. Oh, there's a sign down there in the way. I didn't see it. Alright, this thing tends to once. Okay, it's our way up. But, yeah, I, I really appreciate y'all coming out, folks. Um, like I said, I'm going to put these soybeans into the silo up here. Yeah, both of them's full. Can I get this without running over that sign? Probably not. Okay, we needed some there. All right, that is full. Oh, I got the sign. Here's the sign. Somebody can take it. <laughs> but anyway, folks, thank you for coming out. Like I said, I love each and every one of y'all. Y'all have a great day, a blessed day. But Mr. Blue's going to get out of, out of here. Oh, really? Yeah, right, we're just going to keep it in it. Oops, wrong one. We'll just keep it in our grain cart and carpet. We're going to go up to these other fields. So, yeah, y'all have a great day, a blessed day. And I will see y'all in the next episode of Ravenport. Here on Farming Similar 19, your host, Mr. Blue, a.k.a. Tommy Miller, signing out.